टुडे माय टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज म्यूटेशन म्यूटेशन मींस द चेंजेस इन न्यूक्लियोटाइड सीक्वेंस ऑफ जीन दिस इज कॉल्ड म्यूटेशन सो एक्चुअली वी आर डिपेंडिंग अपॉन द म्यूटेशन सेवरल चेंजेस कैन बी हैपन फेनोटाइपिक चेंजेस ऑफ द ऑफ एनी ऑर्गेनिज्म कैन बी हैपन ड्यू टू द म्यूटेशन और चेंजेस इन द न्यूक्लियोटाइड सीक्वेंस ऑफ द डी एन जी नाउ व्हाट इज प्रीवियसली आई हैव टोल्ड दिस टर्मोनोलॉजी द जेनोटाइप एंड फेनोटाइप अगेन आई एम रिपीटिंग इट टू रिकॉल दिस थिंग्स एक्चुअली व्हाट इज फेनोटाइप फेनोटाइप इज द एक्चुअल व्हाट इज जेनोटाइप फर्स्ट वन इज जेनोटाइप जेनोटाइप इज द जेनेटिक कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन ऑफ द सेल और ऑर्गेनिज्म इट इज कॉल्ड जेनो द जेनोटाइप एंड फेनोटाइप इज द द एक्सप्रेशन ऑफ जेनोटाइप इन ऑब्जर्वेबल प्रॉपर्टीज कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ द सेल और ऑर्गेनिज्म इज कॉल्ड फेनोटाइप so phenotype whatever we are uh, seeing outside the world of the characteristic of any uh, organisms or any animals or any plants whatever we have uh, we are seeing this is all of phenotypes but these phenotypes are due to the genotypes so uh, mutation uh, i have told that so uh, the actually when the Uh, mutations uh, today's topic is mutation actually uh, we have told you the uh, first the dna template will be here and then mrna will be produced by transcription and then ultimate protein will be uh, protein will be produced uh, like that protein Uh, there are several amino acids will be joined and to produce the protein so protein will be produced here finally this is called translation i have discussed all these things uh, in my previous videos so there the uh, thus uh, mutation means the changes in the dna sequence the dna template any gene um, template of any gene A DNA sequence uh, may be like that: A P C G G G C C C like that. And according to the, uh, the according to the uh, sequence, uh, the nucleotide sequence in DNA, mRNA will be produced by transcription, and this mRNA will be ultimately produced uh, produce the protein. So here, any change here. Uh, any letter, any uh, adenine, thymine, uh, cytosine, guanine, any nucleotide uh, sequence will be changed so that the whole uh, the protein, the protein uh, mRNA will be changed, and ultimately the protein uh, amino acid will be changed in the protein sequence, and the protein will be changed. The uh, maybe the protein may be non-functional or it may be. Um, any toxic effect i have already discussed these things elaborately so the mutation is the here any change like a here t may be changed by the g now i am going to discuss about the what are the mutations now first of the things is that that uh, sometimes some physical a uh, physiological adaptation may be happen but it is not mutation Physi physiological ad adaptation may be happen due to the uh, environmental changes and um, the, the physical adaptation it is the um, body pro uh, it is the uh, internal body process to stimulate and uh, um, uh, to regulate and uh, maintain the homeostasis uh, homeostasis uh, uh, for the or uh, any organism living organism uh, to survive in the environment which it exist it is not actually this physical physiological adaptation is not 
and actually the mutation there is no there is no change in the uh, nucleotide sequence of the gene but some adaptation will be happen due to the changes in the uh, environment like that the temperature regulation regulation uh, and uh, any release of toxin or poisons for the defense mechanism of any animals and uh, the, the uh, release of anti freeze proteins to uh, avoid the freezing in cold environment so this physiological adaptations are not mutation we will not uh, we are not going to mix up these things actually this is separate and mutation is the separate mutation is the changes in the uh, sequ nucleotide sequence of the uh, uh, gene particular gene so gene is the uh, uh, functional unit of inheritance we all know that uh, all the protein synthesis depending on the gene uh, present in our uh, in our chromosome i have already discussed these things so um, uh, mutation but this mutation actually generally uh, happen uh, spontaneously uh, in the any living organism uh, during the dna replication time the changes in here uh, any changes can be happened during the uh, dna replication spontaneously but the mutation rate here is very low like uh, the one mutation can be happen in uh, like when i am talking about the uh, bacterial cell one mutation can be happen in 1 million to uh, 1 million to 10 billion bacterial cells one, one cell can be mutated and the uh, among the uh, um, uh, among the uh, 1 billion to 1 million to 10 billion uh, cells so it is very rare thing but it is spontaneously happen and it can change the protein uh, characteristic uh, so uh, uh, and mutation can be happen spontaneously this is the thing and uh, um, this is the mutation rate general mutation rate i have talk, i am talking about and now we come to the point the what is the um, uh, this is a very low rate mutation rate happen during the dna replication time uh, now we come to the point the types of um, how, how many types of mutation can be happen in our um, gene first of all the um, there are two types of mutations types of mutations types of mutation one is main two mutations can be happen point mutation and another is frame shift mutation strain shift mutation so there are mainly two type of mutation in uh, point, uh, point mutation what happen the nucleotide any nucleotide uh, either it may be purine base or a pyrimidine base it will be um, uh, interchange when it will be substituted by another purine and another purine base so on the basis this is called point mutation substitution of nucleotide is called base pair substitution of base pair or nucleotide is called point mutation and frame mutation frame shift mutation is the any deletion or insertion of nucleotide in the existing genetic material so this is called frame shift mutation and point mutations are two types generally are two types uh, one is a uh, point mutation is a transition transition point mutation and another is the transversion point mutation 
transversion point mutation. What is the transition? When any purine base will be substituted by any purine base or any pyrimidine base will be substituted by any pyrimidine base uh, like purine base, adenine, guanine, pyrimidine base we know that, thymine and cytosine. Then it will be called transition type of point mutation. And when one purine base will be substituted by any, any pyrimidine base or any pyrimidine base will be substituted by any purine base, then it will be called transversion point mutation. So, uh, depending on this, uh, uh, this uh, substitution of base pair, another three types of point mutation can be happen. They are like that. They are like that. One is the missense, missense point mutation. Another is the um, uh, nonsense point mutation. And third one is the um, uh, neutral point mutation, neutral point mutation. And what is this missense, nonsense, and neutral point mutation? I am uh, I am explaining it. Actually, in missense point mutation, there will be I have told you there will be any nucleotide base pair will be substituted by another nuclear base pair. In case of sickle cell anemia disease, the fifth amino acid. Uh, of the, uh, the particular uh, um, uh, red blood cells will be uh, altered or changed. Like that, the, the first, of, first of all, the first one is the glutamic acid, glutamic acid, whose um, uh, codon is, uh, glutamic acid will be specified by the codon, like uh, uh, J A G. Now in mutation, this uh, when the sickle cell anemia will be happen, it will be changed to the glutamic acid will be changed to valine. Uh, valine and its codon will be G U G. So only A here will be changed by the uracil. Adenine will be changed by the uracil. Actually, adenine will be uh, ch change here, A, uh, uh, adenine will be changed here by the uh, T, thymine. So the thymine will uh, uh, pair with the, so, uh, sorry, um, uh, the, uh, this is the glutamic acid, the final uh, uh, sequence of that and it will be changed to GUG. So in the A, the template DNA by A will be substituted by the I uh, will know that T T so here when you are uh, here then T will be substituted by A in the original DNA sequence that's why this glutamic acid will be changing the valine and the disease sickle cell anemia will be produced because of this change of this nucleotide sequence the amino acids will be changed uh, and the fifth amino acid will be changed and the fifth this will cause the disease sickle cell anemia. I have already discussed about the what is sickle cell anemia. It is the, the stacking of the red blood cell due to the sickle type of uh, their structure. They will block the oxygen and nutrients to the um, cells and muscles. So this is the uh, cause of the scope and it is called missense mutation, point mutation. And what is nonsense point mutation? I have told you there are three um, codons are responsible for, for the uh, stop of any gene, uh, ending of any gene like uh, U, uh, UAA, UAG, UGA, which will be called O3. Uh, amber umbar and when these changes will be happen the substitution of uh, nucleotide sequence when this uh, this thin three particular uh, stop codon will come in the dna sequence and if the dna will be stopped prematurely and the uh, the protein will be produced premature protein which will be non functional this is called nonsense 
mutation point mutation mean uh, sudden stop of the gene where it will be not supposed to be stop so uh, original gene will be not stop there but here due to the mutation this will be uh, it will be stopped due to the codon and then uh, neutral mutation is the neutral mutation is the uh, i have told that 61 codons will uh, specify the uh, 20 amino acid present in the nature so more than one codon will represent the uh, one particular one amino acid so in if any change in the uh, nucleotide sequence in the dna the uh, mutation will be there the change of nucleotide sequence will be there but there will be no any change of amino acid due to the that same the both uh, the change and the original uh, codon will specify the same amino acid so this is called neutral mutation another thing is called when this uh, this observable change changes phenotype phenotypic of the um, characteristic are seen in the um, particular organism due to mutation it is called mutant and another time uh, another term will come in this uh, uh, dis uh, in this uh, uh, discussion which is uh, friendship mutation i have called uh, i have already told that in case of friendship mutation there will be the change in the, um, the uh, when any nucleotide sequence or any one or more than one nucleotide nucleotide will be added or base pair will be added in the existing gene then the whole frame will be changed reading frame shift of the reading frame will produce the non-functional protein which is not actually useful and this is caused by the frame shift mutation due to the uh, um, uh, shift of the reading frame of the DNA template. This is called uh, frame shift mutation. Insertion or deletion. Any nucleotide um, base pair will be added or deleted. So uh, another uh, I have told that now one interesting thing is that I have told that uh, the mutation rate the spontaneous mutation rate is generally i have told there uh, uh, from the one mutant mutant cell will be in the uh, one among one one million to 10 billion cells uh, so one mutation can be happen so it is very low mutation rate and mutation rate is defined by this term the average the number of mutation per cell per division per cell per division one means one mutation can be happened in the one gene in the one cell among these 10 to the power uh, 1 billion cells or 1 million cells so this is very low the spontaneous mutation happen uh, rate is very low uh, so uh, another term is come uh, another term is coming in this respect that which is called mutagen this what is the mutagen mutagen actually uh, increases the mutation rate mutation rate uh, other other than the spontaneous mutation so it is called the mutagen there are so many uh, in nature there are so, so many mutagens are available uh, one of them is the uv radiation or x-rays this can cause the mutation in the uh, gene so this is called mutagen which will increase the mutation rate uh, in this connection i want to say one thing uh, when any uh, any antibiotic is applied for the treatment of any disease to destroy or kill any pathogenic bacteria like uh, streptococcal pneumonia uh, this type of pathogenic bacteria generally we are applying uh, antibiotics but not we are generally not add, adding uh, applying a single antibiotic we are applying 
more than one uh, antibiotics together to uh, reduce the mutation rate uh, means the streptococcal in case of streptococcal uh, infection we are using two type of antibiotics penicillin G to kill this streptococcal infection to stop this streptococcal infection penicillin G, G and uh, another is the streptomycin generally we are applying streptomycin so these two antibiotics are applied for the treatment of the infection of for uh, due to the infection for the disease due to the infection of the streptococcal pneumonia so what happened uh, if in case of penicillin g the mutant is found like that 10 to the power minus 6 means uh, among 10 to the power 6 cells one mutant you can find which can resist the antibiotic which can survive this antibiotic this pathogen streptococcal pneumonia streptococcus pneumonia can survive this antibiotic and in case of streptomycin the same streptococcus pneumonia in uh, bacteria pathogenic bacteria can uh, there will be only 10 to the power 8 mutants so when uh, we are ap applying penicillin singly and streptomycin singly we will get the chance of survival of mutant uh, one mutant among 10 to the power 6 cells of streptococcus, streptococcus pneumonia in case of streptomycin when we are applying streptomycin there is a chance of mutant which will be resistant to the particular antibiotic will be 10 to the power uh, uh, among 10 to the power 8 cells one mutant so this is the if we combine both together and applying for the disease then the chance of mutant will reduce to 10 to the power minus survival of the chance of the mutant will be reduced to 10 to the power minus 14 so it will be very less there will be no chance of minimal chance of survival of mutant which can survive this uh, both antibiotics so that's why generally in case of any treatment of any disease or bacterial disease we are generally applying combination of two antibiotics to minimize the chances of survival of mutant in the living organism so that there will be no chance of survival of pathogenic bacteria so this is the one interesting thing in medical science we are applying this type of thing uh, in uh, consideration of the uh, mutant which in, which can survive the antibiotics generally why wild type means the original type of the organism the bacterial cell will not be will not survive these antibiotics but some mutant any uh, changes in the nucleotide sequence of the gene of the particular bacteria cell they can survive this particular antibiotic so we can adjust these things now come to the mutagen the term mutagen mutagen will increase the mutation uh, number of mutations mutation rate uh, actually the generally there are some type of mutagens like uvs x-rays uvs what the uvs can do uh, in case of mutation uh, to uh, hap for the happening of the for the occurrence of the mutation in the particular gene uh, what they are doing they are making some dimer uv radiation dimer uh, between two adjacent pyrimidine base especially thymidine thymine especially thymine base they will make some dimer and this dimer will creates the error in the DNA replication. So that's why the mutation can be happened. And X-ray can do the, they can break the um, backbone, phosphodiester backbone of nucleotide. So they are working like that. And uh, another uh, mutagen is the nitrous acid, which can substitute the amino group of 
uh, amino group of purine and pyrimidines. Another uh, mutagens is the um, base analogs. Base analogs are the, those mutagens which are the their structure is almost same to the particular nucleotide. Like we know that thymine has the structure like that. We know that thymine has the structure like that. This is the structure of thymine and its base analogs, uh, same structure like that, uh, like uh, here you can see that it is called 5 bromo uracil base analog. What can be happened here? The CH3 group, methyl group will be substituted by this analog 5 bromo uracil which are the almost same structure of thymine but only the uh, ch changes here is the bromine in, uh, in place of methyl group in thymine. So this type of base analogs can be substituted the original nucleotide like thymine, 5 bromo uracil, but their hydrogen bonding is not the same. So they can create the disturbance in DNA replication, errors, create the errors in DNA replication and that's why the mutation can be happened. And another, uh, another mutagen is the intercalating, intercalating agents. intercalating agents and other mutagens what is intercalating agents actually these agents are like acridine orange acridine orange uh, uh, then uh, probhevin probhevin and uh, mustard nitrogen mustard nitrogen these are the generally intercalating agents actually they what they are doing they are actually uh, intercalating means slipping inserting in the uh, center of the dna stack and distort the structure and uh, it creates error in the dna replication and another uh, term is uh, mutagen is term, term is a viral mutagen which is called uh, transposon which is called transposon it is a, a bacterial virus like mu this uh, a unit of viral dna can be can be moved from one place to one DNA to another DNA and they are inserting there and this is called transposon. Transposon. So this is a unit of DNA. It can be moved. It can move from one place to another place and uh, may cause the mutation. So uh, this is the thing and uh, several things uh, uh, characteristic mutation. Uh, uh, mutation can be uh, repaired. Mutation can be happened in the gene spontaneously and it can be also repaired. In case of UV radiation mutation, it can be um, reversed or it can be repaired by when it will be exposed to the visible light. And there is a pre, P-R-E enzyme involved here to do this type of um, repair. repair. Uh, and the, to the original actually you have to excise or um, uh, cut out the uh, damage DNA dimer I have told you UV radiation caused the dimer production between 
the adjacent thymine uh, pyrimidine base mainly thymine so this is the case of the you can reverse it and another several type of cell has the several types of repair mechanism to repair the mutation and come to its original level original structure so this is called a uh, repair mechanism the several repairing mechanism is there one is the excision repair where several enzymes are involved like endonucleases exonucleases lyases dla polymerases several enzymes are involved in the excision repair in case of e coli uh, escherichia coli bacteria one inducible or sos repair can be happened but this is a problem of this repairing of the mutation is the dna is the they can repair the damaged dna but they can also do some mutation in the another location so this is the problem of the mutation repair mechanism and in case of bacteria when we are talking of the bacterial cell the mutant can be of several characters like the mutant can be uh, maybe resistant i have already discussed these things maybe resistance to certain drug or antibiotics the antibiotic resistance or drug resistant mutant can be uh, produced due to the mutation the uh, mutation can be uh, uh, produced to uh, resistance to some bacteriophage means some virus which are eating killing bacteria they can resistance to this virus uh, by some mechanism and uh, some mutants can be uh, changes their requirement for the nutrition um, some bacterial cell can be changes their re nutrition requirements uh, so that uh, the they can uh, and uh, some are, are can be changes their colonies produced in the um, in the artificial media like uh, any media and uh, they are uh, they can produce also uh, uh, pigments also and uh, some mutations are like that uh, like cryptic cryptic mutation it is called cryptic mutation where the original intracellular enzymes activity will be uh, okay same but uh, some enzymes can be uh, changes uh, uh, there so there are several types of mutant variants can be uh, produced uh, in the bacterial i am talking about the bacterial cell and in the eukaryotic cell same thing can be happen so uh, generally in this uh, mutant i have told you where the mutation can or can be occurred in the organism this is called um, mutant and in mutant the mutant cell will be uh, like uh, proline amino acid production it will be uh, like like that uh, it will be expressed the mutant will be expressed